Um, all right, Hank, you wanna play music? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna play music, though. No, I don't want music. <laughs> the smart speaker we have is the Dot, the Amazon Dot. I use it pretty much every evening to play music, and I usually start with music I wanna to listen to, and then he takes over. All right, Alexa, can you play the pop station in the kitchen? No. Station Top Pop from Amazon Music. I like that. The play on Troll. I think at first I had visions of our son waking up in the middle of the night and talking to Alexa, and it hasn't really shaken out like that. Alexa, stop. Alexa, stop. Alexa, play Elsa. Alexa, Alexa play Frozen. TV is a pacifier, like completely. It's, it's like flipping a switch and your toddler turns off, yeah. which probably can't be good. But Alex is kind of in between because he'll still eat and hang out and make jokes. Before we had our son, we used to put on headline news or CNN yeah, or whatever every morning. Let's say like, "Good morning, Robin." Let's listen to the news. Oh, that's right. Oh, um, but we stopped doing that when he was born because we just. We're trying to minimize the screens, and then we eventually got rid of conventional cable, I guess is what people call it. Uh, Alexa, news. Here's your flash briefing. Alexa, volume up. We can both participate in it if it's kind of read to us, so it's become a more and more frequent thing we use just to keep us on task. Which we need just to prove what they'll want. Oh, yeah. Fake videos? Fake videos of children dying. Right. Because you never know in the world, right? There's a lot going on, and you know, we live in D.C. Um, it's a political city, but not political where we, where we live, but political by nature. And I think um, any concise way you can keep abreast of what's going on is very helpful. Yeah. There you go, bud. Mommy?